94.3 WKUFLP. Again, that was the poor Al's right there with the flight of the devil's son. Yes, flight of the devil's son. So, so, what's behind that track right there? I, um, well, it talks a lot about. It's kind of like based on Pandora's box, okay. slightly. Um, it's about temptation. It's about um, leading astray. Kind of like just going off that path of yours for a little while, and uh, and in that path, I guess there's like the devil who's like constantly on your shoulder, letting you know, keep doing it, keep doing what you want okay. to do. Keep, but then, uh, you know human beings, I guess, you probably shouldn't do that, <laughs> but uh, that's what the song's basically about, it's just like giving in to everything of your heart's desire, being completely selfish. Okay. <laughs> being selfish, man, there ain't, there ain't a lot yeah, of checks about yeah. that. No, there's not. That's, that's cool, I no, like that. Um, so, the poor Al's, and I, I kind of get it right now, I understand, your name is Alan. Yeah, Alan. And you are... Allie. Allie. Yeah. So we got the Al's here. That, so, I don't know, is there any more story behind this? Uh, yeah, there's a little bit. A little bit more story behind the name? Well, she just, um, she used to work at a preschool, and this one time, this one day she came home, and she had written, like, a little kid's, like, just like a two-page story about, okay. like, uh, there was Al, and she was sad, or she was poor, and she wanted to sing. And then there was Al, and he was poor, and he wanted to sing, <laughs> yeah. and then they sang together, and that was it. But. At the end, their life, life was happy, so that's how it came up. And we literally are kind of poor, yeah. so yeah, <laughs> so it kind of works out. Poor Al's right there. It works out. You guys, you save that art for your CD cover or whatever? No, it, it, I put uh, Valentine's Day candy things on it, and they're falling off, so you probably don't want the art on uh, here. <laughs> that's all right. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> so... I know you guys just come up from Virginia. You said you're a military brat. You, you somewhat so also? I was in the military. You were in the military. Okay, okay. So, as, as musicians, like, I see you guys as musicians, but I don't see you other than that at all, really. I see you at the Crave Alliance meetings. I see you playing shows around town. Well, who are y'all outside the music? <laughs> Close to nothing. I mean, that's, that's all I've known. I mean, that's... From the long as I can remember, that's always been like, what I will always do. And, okay. Um, but I, I mean, on, on a different level, uh, community activists, we like right. to be, um, you know, artists of, of all, all sorts of kind. Okay. And making soap and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We like helping out everyone as much as possible, as far as like any just artist or any person out there to like do something awesome for this place. Okay. We want to be like behind that. And yeah, so I mean, if we weren't playing music, we'd still probably be involved with music some way or another. Somewhere or another, yeah, definitely. Hey, I feel y'all, because I don't play at all, but I'm, I'm here involved with right, y'all. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. exactly. Like, we love people like that. So, so again, I want to shout out Bo McVeigh. He just called up here, and he, he wanted to say that y'all's track was was really nice right there. And Thanks, thank you. Thanks, Bo. And, yeah, thank you. <laughs> and uh, this is kind of cool too, because um, last week we had him on the show, and he was really talking about collaborations, and yeah. and you know he kicked out. He said he wants to collaborate with y'all on like a hip hop tip or something. That'd be that awesome. Right. We're down. Thanks, yeah. I know. I know. I just seen we were playing his track earlier, and you had the harmonica out here, so yeah. <laughs> So, Bo, man, the collab's already happening, man. <laughs> you just didn't see it. Yeah. <laughs> no, nah, that's that's really cool, and that, I'm glad. I think that's one of the best things about the Crave Alliance. And Absolutely. I'm really excited to see y'all come up and get into the organization right, around right. the town. And it's, been, it's been one of the most amazing experiences of my life so far, is joining this Creative Alliance. I've never met people like that. I've never seen organizations so passionate, okay. such as the Creative yeah. Alliance. It's just fantastic. Yeah, like, Every Wednesday is my special day because every <laughs> night I show up and I'm just so at ease. And after after we're done, I just feel like you know we get stuff done and everything. And, uh, all the events, I feel so good going to them and everything. So. Mm -hmm. And without it, we we would be we would be just a band that probably not a lot of people knew about. Right. It's kind of stuck in our basement. Right. Creative right, Alliance right. has done a lot for us. And y'all done a lot for Creative Alliance. Yeah. So yeah. we're gonna keep doing it. Too. Yeah, we are. That's what's up. Now I got. I actually do have quite a few more questions for yeah, you. Yeah, man. But but I see Al sitting here with the guitar in his hand. And <laughs> you look. You look like you're ready to make moves here, man. So I. I don't know. You guys want to 
do a little something. Uh, yeah, yeah, we can throw it down. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kick out this other mic so you guys got two mics out. Nice. Here. All right, y'all. This is the poor ass. This is a chance to hear the poor ass live that y'all ain't gonna get. <laughs> y'all ain't gonna get too often. Thanks, Nemo. Uh, yeah. I'll turn the mics up all the way. Yeah, there ain't a very large crowd here, so. 